my country people, Yahweh don't gas like this. Hey, hey, hey. I know so many of you never see this very Yahweh way don't gas like this. So, hey. Una see and say, eh, since we be say me a doche lega team, don't come outside. Go bring that one of bon get gist about you, le doche. Where una go listen to and to so many persons with that we are even coming out. Even some of them that call themselves graduates, they were coming out to tell me, say, go and remove you the name. Go and remove you, Le name. Go and remove the name. A woman that is still legally married to her husband. Now say make go remove the name. Hey, <laughs> well, okay. Why una not go tell a uh, root boy, S wife that they call uh, Anita Okoye to remove her name? Una go try him. Root boy where it leave and made the woman they answer the name and also they co-parent in peace with that woman. Now this ain't no get sense. <laughs> hey, my people, my people. Egbe gaso. Not be small way, not be you day like this. As a matter of fact, eh, you edoche know very well, deep down his heart, that Queen May Edoche can never put into JJ. He no say may no go fit put on for we JJJ. But because now table don't turn on, make sure they listen very well. May might not be the person to do it. There are some cases where it be say even the victim will not want to do it, but the, the court will be forced to do it because of the law that abides or covers that very situation. Do you understand? Even when the the victim go say, okay, you know what? In I leave it for God. I want to leave the person, make the person go free. But you see, the law will say no, even though you refuse. We being the legal practitioner or be the judge, we will impose the law on that very person. We make you go through what you go through, despite the fact say you know one time. I believe say you and don't you don't begin to hear some kind of one game matter to that area. Now you make a way you don't run up and down right now. Anyways, before we enter this, just make a welcome on our first. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Patience Blogs. My wonderful and amazing people, I welcome you all. In case you have not subscribed to Patience Blogs official on YouTube, please don't forget to hit on the subscribe button. Turn on notifications so that you will get notified anytime I drop a new one. I want to say a very big thank you to all my subscribers and my returning subscribers. I appreciate you all to my members. May God bless and replenish your pockets. Please, if you are not joined our membership, don't forget to hit on the join button to join our membership. And if you've done that, I appreciate Appreciate you so much. May God bless and replenish your pockets. Now make we enter matter. <laughs> hey, don't gas Kasala everywhere. Area not clear for the areas of Una Act. What do they call you? You you. <laughs> oh, yeah, Mary, yeah. I always they ask. Now who do this man this thing? Ah, Juju Austin. You know go better for Juju Ekwen Sumura when the husband snatches snatch. Because this woman is settled and carry this man from hero to zero. Hey, hey. God I beg. We could be say now other people will be say they be legend like. Like you before you will be legend before if some person's post you you're gonna celebrate chai oh 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 this don't really go wrong go my people so now they say that a lot is happening and you leduchi as beginning to go around looking for people because all the persons that would have helped him out when it comes to you you'll have spoiled the way for them you'll by himself spoil everything those persons cannot Help him because why? You'll by himself scatter everywhere. He scatterize everything all by himself. We because of what? Because of social media validation. I must belong. I want online in-laws to see me say I be Odogu. Not knowing say you are not Odogu or Guinea, you know. <laughs> hey now, wow, God. Which kind which kind which kind for the hand be this? Hey now. Hey, who do you let say this one? People they run away from you, let me my people. People they run away. Now, he get within the legal team bring out what I want to show now. Where you a doche talk about. Let me show you guys. So I go allow now listen to audio. Make una wait. But I want to read this thing for now. This was what you a doche said. May a doche legal team they get them for hand. And this alone is a problem for you, a doche. The part where you'll talk about this is you a doche's verified page. He said. I am a proud polygamist with my full chest. Read Exodus 21 verse 10. The, Bible's, the Bible acknowledges polygamy. It is my destiny. God directed me to do it so I can give my son a proper identity. Therefore, it came with many blessings. Blessings for me. Blessings for my wife, Queen May, to calm her down because as a human being, 
she would definitely not be happy about it. And blessings for my sec for my wife, Judy as well. <laughs> you hear that part? You say my wife. <laughs> you don't call her your wife, finish. <laughs> you say, in I am a very solid man of God with so much grace. You may not understand my life and say negative things about me. I won't blame you. It is my life, not yours. <laughs> I don't laugh. <laughs> so you are not su supposed to understand it. Dear Lord, <laughs> I acknowledge your abundant blessings in my life. <laughs> in my family. I just want to say thank you, Lord. My mouth will forever testify your goodness. May your mighty name be praised forever and ever. <laughs> Amen. Now let's listen to what the legal team said. And this is the reason why I want many of you to listen. Just listen to what the legal team of Meyadoche said before I will play the audio that I want to play for you guys. The legal team said, cruelty comes in different form. Mental torture is the worst form of it. Many people wonder how DPA became involved in the case of Yuleduche. As you must have known, DPA is not a law firm. Even though we maintain a network of lawyers and law firm in Nigeria and other countries, we are a consortium of justice intervention group. One of the top challenging challenges we have in Africa is how to reduce gender-based injustice in Africa. This means empowering women and giving them a voice. We have been receiving messages and calls from women all over Africa and other parts of the world. All those women are saying the same thing. The case of May Yul Edoche is the case of all women whose rights in marriage has been abused. We stand with May because we see it a bit of us in the case. Therefore, justice for May is justice for women all over the world, especially in Africa. These women thank DPA for the advocacy it has given to this cause. Indeed, a female lawyer from Zimbabwe and another from Kenya contacted us two days ago to express their active support. Many male lawyers are in support of DPA as well because they have sisters and daughters. They would not want to be treated so unjustfully. So, Kwime's case is a just cause. And in the interest of women all over the world, it has become a movement for the liberation of all women from abusive marriages. How did we get involved in this case? It is very simple to answer. We saw the message in the attached screenshots, the one I just read just now, by Yul. We knew that Yul was not just hurting his wife. He was trying to set a new standard of abuse of women by men because Yul was a well-known actor and a celebrity. We, understand, we understood that the thousands of other men might see him as an example and try to follow his act. Indeed, you'll abuse his star power in the most dangerous way possible. He was about to lead millions of men, especially the poorly educated ones, into a dangerous new territory of women abuse through his false claim that God inspired his polygamy. It was a very dangerous claim that must be shut down immediately. DPA felt an urgent need to stop him. That was why we got involved. We did not see our work as tackling just one man, you rather. We aimed to stop the millions of men he was to lead astray. Your ski making partner called him Isimili, which means the fountain head of the stream. Indeed, Yul has acted as an Isimili 
but flowing from his fountain is not clear stream of water, but rather a stream of abuse and cruelty to women. If you are in doubt, just read and understand the significance of the message he left in this screenshot, which we have attached. He elevated his cruel and selfish actions to the level of God's commandment. He claimed that God inspired him to cheat on his wife and lie to his wife, to his parents, and to his followers for five years. What kind of God does that? How could you stand before God and exchange a vow of monogamy with your wife? And the same God will later instruct you to break the vow? How many gods does Yul Edoche worship? When Yul elevated cruelty and abuse to a divine act of God, DPA felt the need to stop that. And we are happy he did not get away with that. Every wannabe polygamist after Yul should know it won't be easy. It will end up in merry scheme making if he is lucky. Otherwise, it could lead him in prison. What you did is an extreme act of cruelty and physiological torture on his wife and children. He has continued in that act every day and each time he makes his nasty skis with that woman, he displays cruelty towards his wife and children. It is astonishing that Yul does not understand the pain he inflicts on his family. Through all this macabre display on social media, it now borders on insanity of him to continue in such behavior. DPA stands on this until there is justice for all the victims of this extraordinary cruelty. Now, make Una listen to waiting DPA talk in the areas of divorce, where so many women were coming out to say, may she remove you like chest name. That's to tell you the way this, we took go get bad people for Nigeria. So many women for Nigeria, they don't so much deal with them, deal with them, deal with them to the lens where come be say, they self call accept. Once they see you, they live comfortable in your marriage, it depends them. And once your marriage break like this, now them go fair come, come stand as the advocate to tell you what to do in your marriage. Whereas they have no clue whatsoever to even, have, to even interfere in the areas of law or in the areas of marriage. Because their own not only abuse, not be their love where their husband they give them. Now listen to what the DPA said. People are very confused. You wanted a divorce, you filed for it. Just imagine. It was granted. Why are you still keeping the marriage? It wasn't thing? granted, Mumu woman. You better still keep your divorce. Divorce and go your separate ways. That is what a woman said. Can you imagine such extreme ignorance? Honestly. Yes, that particular case you referred to. Divorce has not been granted. Oh. But even if divorce was granted, why would a woman expect her to drop her name used during her marriage? A name a woman had invested in for 20 years. Can you imagine? You tell her to drop that name That's all we see because of divorce. Mm. On what basis? I would expect to hear this sort of thing coming from a from man. A man. Surprisingly, the men are not making the argument. It's the women. The men are not making the argument. So the sad. I haven't seen any man asking a woman to drop her name after divorce. It is women. Honestly. This. Why is it? So the conclusion is that women are actually extremely detrimental. Honestly. To themselves. Honestly. Women's suffering are caused by other women. Of like course. So what do we do? Do we now blame the women who cause suffering of other women? We can criticize them, but we must understand that that is part of the mental conditioning. Hey, These women have been so oppressed. Yes, now. 
over the years and through history mm -hmm. that I have joined in oppression. Honestly. You wouldn't be surprised to hear that during the slave era, so it's not surprising that women are being used to abuse other women or that women are participating in the abuse of other women. So we will look out for this and let us not be discouraged. Don't ever say, oh, well, it is women against women, so men have no role in it. It is essentially a world controlled by men. Men set these standards and it's unfortunate but not surprising that some women will accept the exploitative uh, environment and begin to champion it. So you see women criticizing women, women not understanding that the, whatever a woman suffers, any other woman can suffer it. Tell them. Okay? Thank you. You hear it? You hear that? Now what if we they see oh, women? Now that they come out before all of them were coming out until when they now heard that you Ledoche has not even signed for, signed for divorce. <laughs> you has completely refused to sign divorce. How did they feel now? Those that were coming out to say, let her go and remove the name. Let her go and remove the name. Who is the person uh, 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 verging for divorce? Is it not me? Why has you not signed it? Go and ask you. I will leave it here. Thanks for watching. Patience blocks. Bye-bye.